So we have people who are graduates from the best universities, best universities in the world, you know, Ivy League universities, and the students can be exposed to them. The students of our MBA program could be exposed to the, to the Nobel Prize winner for economy. It is an academically challenging program. like teachers know your name and like they they focus on you they know what you need you can talk to them anytime you can email them whenever you have a problem with your homework or if you have any questions it's really nice and they're all very helpful it's wonderful cuz I feel like it it breaks the barriers of it being a professor and a student some of them to really care about us and even um, they care personally about us. We feel that they really want you to be better at what you're doing in your job. It is really what they promise, a personalized um, study. The way they teach us, the practical approach they have to us, is very important for the future. Well, they concentrated really to the, um, let's say, to the, um, to the important things. They get, you know, classes that are as challenging or maybe as uh, free as they want them to be, and there's a lot they can do with that. It's up to them. They can. There's great flexibility there. I think just, just this historical part of the town, like whenever you just go for lunch out of school, anywhere is perfect. Actually, when I first saw this school, I really wanted to be here because I love the location. Every day I walk to school, I'm so excited. Uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't get tired crossing Charles Bridge. Uh, I use the city as an open classroom. We just make a course. We, I, I make a lecture on, um, on some architecture style or on, on something and we go out to see it. My mom's like, she's coming like, she's came, she, like she came here like twice already. And so it's a good reason for her to visit and buy some Bohemian crystals. So. When I told my friends, you know, I'm moving to Prague, everyone's like, okay, sign me up, and we already have a schedule of who's going to come visit, and I'm excited to show people the city. All the time there is going on something, you know. There is no boring weekends or something. You All the time you have what to do. Not millions of bars in Prague, so you can choose to go anywhere. I feel very safe going even down in the metro all times of night. You don't really need to worry about what time of the day it is because there's so many people out and about in the city, and, and it's good, you know, so I feel safe. My mom feels very comfortable with me being here. Historically, we've had over six different nationalities here at school, which I think is impressive. It's definitely beneficial to have people coming in from other societies, bringing their ideas and the way they view things. One of the classes I took was um, conflict resolution, and in that class, it's interesting when you get students from the Balkans or students from these countries that we're talking about who can give their personal experience. It's for the students, I think this is the challenge for them and also the, the real what is affirming for them is they suddenly see a different world out there. We can really exchange knowledge and uh, exchange experiences under each other. I like it. It uh, makes the whole thing uh, much more valuable to me. I was afraid, of course, if all the things they wrote there on the website are going to be true, and they were, and that's why I'm very satisfied. It took me probably one day to realize that I made the right decision. <laughs> 